Hello guys, hello guys, hello guys, and hello guys, hello guys, hello guys. Welcome to another one of my Case Clicker campaign videos. The Case Clicker campaign series is a series where I'm playing Case Clicker from the very start to the very end on this iPad here, showing everything that's going on, meaning every tap for money, every case search, every unboxing, every everything really is being shown. The point that we are at now is that we are the global elite, we're doing Bravo cases, we're doing uh, CSGO weapon cases, we're tapping for money, doing cobblestones, gods and monsters. We're at the end game, looking for the factory new Dragon Lord, the factory new Medusa, the factory new Karambits, Fade, Stat Track and the factory new Stat Track AK-47 Fire Serpent. Because this takes so much money, I'm splitting up the videos meaning that one episode and that is this one is going to be about tapping for money also tapping for cases so this episode here is only going to be about me clicking to show the process from having the starting balance to the point where we can buy and unbox the different things in this batch of videos the next one is going to be unboxing then there's going to be some cobblestones and depending on how many CSGO weapon cases I'm going to be raking in that may be um, a fourth video really. So with that said and done, it's time to go into clicking really. And um, before I do that, I'm just gonna answer like the typical question, how do I get my ninja cases? How do I get cases so fast? I can tap the cases like this and they show up almost instantly. And it's like, it's, it's a common question. So I try to answer it uh, every few times I make these videos it is about going into the game settings into the gameplay options and removing the case draw animations if that is enabled as it is now when you tap for the cases you're going to get this stuff here it looks nice it really does uh, <laughs> but if you're gonna be doing thousands of cases you may want to go back in and remove the case draw animations just like that that's gonna allow you to um, rake up uh, cases a bit faster really. Um, in this video here I'm going to be tapping at least 50 Bravo cases. We have none. If I get so that I have a hundred CSGO weapon cases I'm gonna be doing an episode where I unbox those as well because I want to have 50 of those at any given time so that they don't swap positions with the Bravo cases when I'm doing the unboxings. Um, I, I really wanted to start out by tapping for money. Uh, <laughs> I just kind of started doing this. And somehow I think it's okay really because um, I don't have that bonus weapon on the screen. If you guys have been tapping a lot for money or cases or just playing the game in general, you know that sometimes there is this random weapon appearing, this random skin that just shows up somewhere and when you tap on it, you get it. And that is a good thing. Uh, unless you are trying to click for a very long time for money, then it is a bad thing. If it shows up right where you're clicking, because the combo you build up when you are tapping for a lot of money is going to be lost or there is a good chance that it gets lost if you accidentally click on this random appearing weapon um, so yeah I do prefer to tap the money when I have one but the truth is that um, I generally open this is uh, this is my daughter's iPad and um, yeah I, I use it <laughs> when she's in bed to make this campaign video series and that also means it's, it's not really just being played on before this uh, in case clicker anyway um, so it's never really ready um, I could you know let it be while I'm doing something else but I really try to make these campaigns as much as I can and as often as I can meaning that yeah uh, <laughs> I kind of just go a bit with the flow so I'm hoping that if I just continue tapping for cases to start out with I am going to be uh, seeing that ninja weapon appear somewhere and I'm not tapping that fast this is just you know going a bit casually about it uh, getting <coughs> the random skin time to appear uh, hopefully in the menu area so that I can uh, continue clicking either for money or for cases I could also go like this if I wanted to and do both um, 
it is possible really to maintain the combo while you click for cases at the same time um, there is also a great chance that you actually lose it um, sometimes I like challenging myself by doing this just to really practice on my fingers doing left hand on money and right hand on cases because it does allow me to build up a bit of a combo but at the same time uh, so see where the weapon is this is a bad place to have the weapon we're going to have to get rid of it just like that I could have focused my tapping in this area here but I do want to tap with both fingers um, so yeah I kinda had to get rid of it so it was a good thing I wasn't because normally I tap like this with my left hand in the coin area and my right hand uh, in the show money area and then I would have accidentally picked up that skin really so um, that was a pretty nice one to um, to avoid and yeah I'm just raking in cases while waiting for it to spawn somewhere a bit more interesting for me so let's see how many we do have <clears throat> yeah only 11 bravo cases so uh, lots of lots of lots of time left that we can tap around in the case area um, wait for another skin hope for it to appear really in the menu I wouldn't mind that and I have to say if it doesn't I can also wait it out really uh, uh, like most often I just I go with the flow and if it appears I just lose the combo and I start up again I'm just not really in the mood for that today <laughs> I'm much more in the mood for just going uh, on my click streak raking in my money and not being disturbed by randomly appearing skins so uh, yeah I'm crossing my fingers it's close to impossible to tap with crossed fingers there. I mean, I can do it, but it's no good. Oh, no, it's not. So. Come on. Come on, come on. Good skin position, all Bravo cases, all CSGO weapon cases. It's all good all the time. Just bring it in. I'm gonna answer another question now really even though I doubt uh, that many watch these clicking videos uh, and that is about the case search I do get quite a few questions about why do you get so good cases when you're tapping for cases um, and that is the strategy I have been going towards <coughs> through the entire series it is a plan it's not an accident it's not a hack it's not a glitch it is because in your upgrades area you have the option to like so you can unlock vanguard cases or you can unlock phoenix cases if you don't buy those unlock csgo weapon case 2 unlock huntsman cases i haven't bought these and since i haven't bought them they are not unlocked and as such i cannot get them so i have chosen not to buy anything until I got the Bravo cases and when I only have the Bravo cases and I also have the CSGO weapon cases now and the breakout cases I can only get those three cases when I'm searching so the game is designed to give you um, the breakout cases more often than the rest um, so it's not like I'm getting one and a third of each um, I'm keeping these cases for statistical purposes. These breakout cases are the ones I've gotten since I started tapping for Bravo cases and CSGO weapon cases. So, like 5,068 of those, 1,800 of these, 52 opened, and of course the 83 there. So, those are like um, the percentage chances you can calculate of getting each. Um, that is um, of course you need to to add both the amount of open cases uh, and the ones in the inventory you don't need to do that with the breakout because I kinda stopped opening those um, so they're just really there to make it easier to get an idea about how how rare is it to get the Bravo case or the breakout case or you know whatever case uh, the CSGO weapon cases were not added at the same time as the Bravo cases so those cannot really be used for the same kind of statistics but if you are interested you can of course track down the videos 
and find out when uh, when they were added. It's, I mean, that is what this series has. It has all of the different things that happen in the video. I'm explaining everything as I do it, uh, trying to give a good reason as to why I'm doing the things I am when I'm doing it. Um, so yeah, that's um, that's the entire purpose of this series, really, to to show everything and explain everything in case there are questions about moving from silver with nothing to crazy pants with everything at some point in the game. And we're not there yet. We don't have any of the four items we really need. We have Medusa, Dragon Law, Karambit Fade and Fire Serpent, but none of them in their best condition, but it is gonna happen. Oh yes it is. So I wouldn't mind seeing that um, seeing that weapon skin somewhere now. So that I can start raking in the money. I mean, I do need to click for the cases anyway, so it's I mean, it's no biggie. Um, just prefer tapping with fresh fingers on the money. But now they're gonna be quite a few cases old or worn out, if you prefer that. Well worn fingers. I've worn them all my life. <clears throat> so I am curious, how many do I have? 32. So we're not even there yet. Yeah, That's really how crazy uh, case searching is. <coughs> Sorry guys. So of course 32 Bravo cases, that's 960 bucks. Uh, you don't need to tap for. Um, you could argue that it's faster to tap for the money and buy the Bravo cases. Um, but you don't need a combo. You can just do this, go in one, two, three, and you can get yourself three cases. And I do know a lot of people, they don't play for as long time in a row as I do. Um, so having the Bravo and CSGO weapon cases in the search progress here, in the search for cases area, really allows you to, to get them without building up the crazy combo multiplier. Uh, because you do need that if you want to buy them, uh, if you want to do it like with a decent amount of time invested uh, for each case really that's that's how I look at it anyway so. yes it is, yes it is well at least I have coffee cheers guys ooh bravo so come on come on wherever you are I actually forgot to check out how many CSGO weapon cases I have. I would really like to go above 100 on those. Perhaps I'll just farm them now that I'm doing this because it was crazy cool to open them the last time around. Um, I was so lucky it was uh, it was almost a joke really. Um, so I wouldn't mind adding that kind of value to the account again. Plus it's addition additional chances to get the Karambit Fade. We did get a Marble Fade the last time. Uh, but we don't want the, the marble part on it, we just want the Karambit Fade. Factory New, Stat Track, yes please, that is the name of the game. So I'm thinking we just got one, let's see, 93 weapon cases, 41 Bravos, so that is actually 94, wow, that is actually pretty cool. Looks like it's gonna be uh, doable. I may go a bit higher then on the Bravo cases, uh, which is okay. We're gonna need them at some point, so <laughs> I, guess, I guess there is no reason to uh, to not go for the CSGO weapon case 100 mark this time when I really really want them. I do actually want 101, so then I will have 51 of them when I'm done opening, keeping it above 50 at all times. Um, Oh goody. So where is that skin hiding? The randomly appearing skin. It would be very nice to be able to disable it because it's worth nothing and it's just super annoying really. So that would be a nice uh, future feature to be able to uh, enable or disable. So. I'm thinking we're getting close, at least with the Bravos now. I was clicking the wrong place. 
So I wasn't really hitting the button. That's um, that's what you call silly. So oh, come on. I have a bit of a laggy connection right now, but it's each time uh, the case really uh, pops out, it takes a bit longer. Not really sure why. Um, as always, I'm doing this when nobody else is using the Wi-Fi or the internet connection, like perhaps in the entire country of Denmark, but uh, yeah, it is what it is. So, come on, come on, wherever you are. No, you don't want to do the breakout thing. Don't, no, go home, breakout cases. You don't want to do that. Oh, no, you don't. Why? Why breakout? Who asked you to join the party? Okay, I need to... <coughs> I need to stretch my back a bit here. So, cases... 52 Bravos, 96 CSGO weapon cases, so just 4 additional reds, and then, well, 5 actually, then we are in the zone. <coughs> <coughs> wow, all that uh, crazy Danish bad weather is really getting to my throat. So, oh, come on. Come on, you know you wanna. I'm gonna have the world's largest collection of digital cases here with <laughs> with the with the breakout ones. It's like if they added the Minecraft feature to this, I could build an entire universe out of the <laughs> out of the breakout cases. Oh boy, this is uh, it is actually a bit silly that I have so many, but um, yeah, it kind of shows how much tapping that has been done. Okay, more brothers. It's just gonna make it faster the next time around. So it's always nice. Another thing that is nice is that if I don't see the skin, the randomly appearing skin, um, before I start clicking for money, I know it, it, I mean, it can't take that long for it to appear. So even if it does appear somewhere really, 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 really annoying, uh, I won't be losing a 10x combo on it. Uh, probably just gonna be like 3 or 4 or something. So, yeah, that's also, um, it's better like that, really. Even though it's a huge waste of time, it's still better. So, come on. Come on. No. Yeah. There we have one of them. Goody, goody, goody. A very welcome addition to the batch of... CSGO weapon cases. Oh boy. Really. Really, really, really. Is that the best you can do? Goody, goody, goody. So we're almost home safe now. And um, yeah, I like that. I really do like that. Goody, goody, goody. Like a ninja. Come on, randomly appearing skin of badness. Show yourself. There we had a CSGO. So, one more, right? Two more, actually. Okay. Well, okay then, one more. Wow, that was cool. I had, I mean, if you get the good ones in the streak, you kind of have to continue. Not that I'm gonna do this like uh, crazy now, I just... Um... So, let's see what we have here. 60 Bravos, 101 CSGO weapon cases, and yeah, 5,219 breakout cases. But what it really means is that I can turn my iPad like this, and... I can uh, do my tapping. A lot of you guys, well not a lot, but like three or four people have been asking me to show the tapping a bit more. How do you tap is the question. And this here is because a lot of people 
again, being less than 10, for me it's a lot of people that I can potentially help. I've been asking, how do you tap with more than one finger? Uh, I use two, and I pretty much go like this, up and down with them. I have them closer together, so I'm like, I'm making like a scissors kind of move without the fingers actually touching each other. So it's like, like a drummy scissors kind of motion. Um, and that is what I'm uh, practicing to do also with my left hand. So I'm um, not sure how useful this is in terms of, um, of helping you guys. Some can do it with three fingers. Uh, I can do it, but sometimes I swap in and out of the games. And uh, you can avoid that if you if you remove the multi gesture thing from your settings. Uh, but since this isn't my device, I am um, I'm not gonna go change ninja stuff on it. Um, so time to get started, really. No skins, no money, and um, that's bad. So how much money do I need today? Way too much is what I need. Uh, I need 5,500 for the cobblestones. Yeah. Then I need about 1,100 for... Um, I need to open 100 cases today, so that's... Uh, stat track guarantees 800, 250 in keys. So yeah, it's... Um, it's 1,050 plus the 5,500, so um, 6,550 is the minimum amount of money that I need to rake in. So um, it's going to be about, you know, the 3,000 is pretty much just building up uh, the combo. And then it's going to be some money after that. <coughs> I'm not expecting to stop below 7,000. I would like to go a bit higher, just really have a little money to work with. Uh, I was I was crazy down balance wise now, not that it really matters since I do need to click anyway, uh, but I, I do feel that it is nice to have some degree of account balance instead of just having snake eyes because if I wanted to I could just have gone in and done like uh, the case unboxings now uh, if I didn't really have time to farm for the money uh, the cobblestones and gods and monsters those are the really expensive things right now because we cannot tap to earn them we must buy them um, and they are pretty expensive uh, not like the most expensive ones in the game I know that but they are pretty expensive so it does take quite a bit of time building up the 10x combo and then earning the thousands afterwards um, but yeah, I'm not complaining, just um, just talking really. Um, <coughs> and while doing that, I have been playing uh, quite a few puzzle-like games lately. Um, I'm not sure why I have found like some kind of puzzle mojo mode in my mind that I really wanted to go solve these uh, mysteries and. Uh, try out different things. Um, the two images about above my head, uh, the topmost one for a game I played today for the first time. I actually made eight episodes of uh, videos for that game. It's called The Room. It is probably the most visually stunning uh, puzzle game I have ever seen. Um, it is very, very, very well made. Uh, definitely something I can recommend you guys check out. It is. Um, if you're into puzzles, uh, it is it is just beyond amazing, really. Uh, so I do hope to actually complete that game, like, one of the next days. <laughs> I need to go in there again. That's how, that's how cool I think the game is. And below that, the Human Resource Machine, a game by the developers of Little Inferno. And that is pretty much a game. I feel it's a logic puzzle game. But it will it will teach anybody that plays it really how to become a computer developer at least the logic behind it. Definitely also something I uh, I really 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 recommend you guys uh, check out if you are into that type of games. If you're not, then of course it blows. 
but yeah, I like them. I, I really like them. So I'm looking very much forward also to doing more episodes on both of those games. Um, really spreading out a bit here now because so many cool games on sale lately. Some cool release titles also I want to look into. So much going on in the gaming world that it is just a fantastic time to be a gamer really. Even if you're doing free games or budget games or new releases, just so much stuff going on right now. It is completely crazy cool. And yeah, I like that. <laughs> I really, really like that. What I don't like is not seeing that um, randomly positioned free skin yet because um, I'm moving up towards the 4x combo here and it's not there. So that is a bit of a bummer. But really, I was hoping to have seen it before I reached 3x, since I did actually spend quite a bit of time farming the additional cases. But it's hiding, and that is very rude. It is very rude. Yes, it is. So, come on. Well, at least we're hitting the 4x now, so... Um, it won't be able to hit us at a 3x combo, oh no it won't. So just gonna be sipping a bit of my uh, coffee here while I left hand tap a bit. Cheers guys. I've said this quite a few times during these clipping, clipping, clicking videos. Um, it is not important to like, click really fast. The important thing is to continue so that you can click past the point where you have the 4x combo. Uh, obviously the faster you tap, the faster you build up the combo, but even if you just do this one finger style, just as where we are now, we're getting more than four times the, the normal value. And it is really about continuing past the point where you get ten times as much uh, for your time, for your tap. Uh, and that is where you really need to, to put in your energy once you have the 10x combo and just try to go like as far as you can with that 10x combo because that is where you make the money. Um, I always feel the, the tapping gets a lot more fun once you beat the 6x multiplier. Uh, you only need to build up the 9 because you have the 1 and when you've done 6 so that you build up the 5 you're really already like in the sweet spot kind of position where the money is coming in pretty fast and um, in the first few combos here are just so much of a drag really I mean building up <clears throat> so I've done like 800 bucks when I reached the 5x combo and that is clicking full combo points uh, but when I reach the 9x I'll have built up like twice as much and I'll probably be like at the 2800 ish area um, so yeah it's a lot faster to tap already from here on there it is the free random skin appeared just below where I was tapping at the coin where the case searches so that is a decent place for me to have it um, at least now I can try to tilt the iPad a little bit more here. <coughs> Sorry, to get an angle. That makes it uh, even harder for me to accidentally tap on it. Uh, would be very nice if uh, it just minds its own business down there by the case. Yeah, I just had to stretch my back a bit. I don't have like a good gamer chair and stuff like that. I am gaming in my kitchen on my dining table chair at my dining table. So yeah, not really ideal for long-term gaming, but um, yeah, it is what it is. And we reached the first thousand, so I guess somehow that is a milestone quite a bit of a uh, way left really but that is also because I really wanna I would like to crush it a bit today and really open those additional uh, cases by doing 
doing the CSGO weapon cases on top of the Bravos and the cobblestones. So, yeah. But, 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 we are soon moving into the fun part where we have the high end multiplier. And then it's like farming the money doesn't feel as tough once you get there. But really getting to it is, uh, it can be a bit crazy. So, more money. So we're in the good spot now. At 6x plus, tapping, 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 trying to do it with both hands, and yeah, just raking in those bananas. No, they're not bananas. They're not bananas. Why do you say that? Why do you say bananas when they're not? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, man. So, coffee time. Cheers, guys. Oh, goody. We're going. Oh, yes, we are. We're going like crazy. So, 1500, almost, anyway. I'm a bit curious to see if we will have reached the 2800 when we hit the, the 9x multiplier like I thought we would. I've never really been looking like exactly at the values, so I could be like way shooting wrong there, but um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Yes, we will. Yeah. Alrighty, almost hitting seven here, and uh, yeah, I like that. Seven X combo, sixteen hundred dollars. Still missing like five thousand. Yeah, I'm sorry, my hand was really hitting uh, the razor there. It could have really affected uh, <laughs> the audio. Um, I normally have this like pillow thing I have my uh, daughter's iPad on a little differently positioned um, I'm actually sitting very bad today compared to what I normally do I'm not really sure why but now that I am doing the click streak thing I'm not gonna be moving I need to stay put and tap tap for the money And I might as well be honest, my fingers are pretty tired because I have been going crazy pants in on Beat Bub. Uh, also played uh, some Hero Strike and a little bit of Warriors of Num Num. So uh, yeah, I have um, I have been tapping. Let's just put it like that. And my fingers are telling me you have been tapping. Perhaps you should uh, you should do some more of the room or some more of the human resource machine and tap a little less. No. No. I'm not gonna. Oh no, I'm not. I'm not gonna. So, I am um I really wanted to turn the the iPad around, but I'm a little afraid of losing the combo now. It's just really because I'm sitting so bad. Well, well. What an awkward situation. So, come on. So let's see the 1x combo build up remaining and um, if I'm right and I'm gonna have like 600 more here it looks like I'm gonna be hitting that range so, so yeah I was correct it's really building up more than twice as much money for <laughs> for the remaining tiny bit of, uh, of the combo there it's pretty crazy but that is the effect of having the combo it is pretty nice My fingers are saying no. Nothing 
have another sip of the coffee. That's what they're saying. So come on, come on, wherever you are. Not even halfway there. But if you consider the time used for the low end combos, we are way more than half there. So it's a bit odd like that, but in value we are not halfway there yet. So if you guys know any cool puzzle games that you want to recommend, since I'm kind of in like a puzzle mode now, uh, when I'm not case clicking, uh, please do let me know. I am. Uh, I feel very much in the mood to solve crazy epic uh, mysteries. Um, also have some other pretty nice looking games that I bought today and that I am going to be sharing a bit about. Uh, most of them I haven't even looked into yet. I bought them, installed them, but. Um, I haven't had them up and running because I really do like recording the first time I try a game um, regardless of whether it's a positive or negative impression I get I really do like sharing that alrighty so hitting with 3000 and yeah, I like that. Yes, I do. This is where it gets silly. We're raking in more than 3,000 while building up the combo from 1.00 to 10x. So earning another 3000 now of course it's not 10 times faster because we have had an increasing combo throughout the entire buildup but um, it is just so much faster to uh, to earn the money now than it is in the buildup it's crazy it's really silly but uh, it is what it is Right, so finally we hit the 10x combo, and then, um, yeah, I really do like that. I really do like that. This is where the actual tapping starts, and uh, like I said, go as long as you can when you reach this point. Um, I am going to stop when I have enough to do the openings. Um, because I'm really in the mood. Sorry, did the mic thing again. I'm really, 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 really in the mood to uh, to open those uh, special of the CSGO weapon cases. So I'm saving those for last because I'm really looking forward to those. Um, I mean, for you guys, it doesn't really matter, I guess, because it will be added at the top of the list. Uh, but I really want to save it uh, as a treat to myself, uh, doing that as the last of these uh, videos here today. Going to... Uh, gonna do the bravos then I'm gonna do the cobblestones and then finally the CSGO weapon cases so that's the plan oh yes it is Go, go, four thousand. We're coming for you. We're coming for you. Four thousand. Right around the corner. So I need to do just about two thousand more as a minimum. So yeah, 
Many, many, many. I may, I'm always trying to be, not always, but ever since I did lose a 10x combo the first time, I'm uh, trying to be a bit cautious when I have it, because it's better to go like this. I mean, even if I have to go like this, just one fingering it, from now on till I have 6000, that is better than dropping the combo. It is super important not to lose that 10x combo multiplier. Um, so like going crazy pants clicker and then losing it, like worst case scenario really. Oh goody. Another small quarter of a thousand earned in. Just need like um, 10 of its friends to be on the safe side. Come on. You cannot hide your money from me forever. From me, not for me. You can give it to me. Yes, you can. Right on. That was one. 4,500, another thousand, and we have the cobblestone secured. Or rather, we have the funds necessary to buy them. And that is a nice milestone. Come on, tap faster, I can't, I can't, I can't tap faster, I'm tapping as fast as I can, okay, and I guess we can't ask for more, no you can't, can't ask for more than the best, that someone can do, 4, 8, Goody, 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 closing in on 5,000. So those were the first, the first, but in about 2,000 tapped after reaching the combo multiplier. Not good enough yet, I know. I know, it's not good enough. But, uh, closing in on it. And that means coffee time. Cheers, guys. Oh, yeah, just like that. Tap, 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 tap. Fantastic. Fantastic. 5,200. Just keep pushing. Five two fifty. Come on, you can do it. You know you can. 5,500 almost there. The amount we need for the cobblestones. Officially secured now, meaning that keys and stat track guarantees. That is what we're missing. 1,050. Meaning that 6,550. And we are pretty home safe. And yeah, today I think I'm just gonna end it there really because I need to do my unboxing. Probably gonna land the 7000, you know, just, just for reference. 
and in case I see something I need to buy impulsively. So that was another 250 shaved away. So come on, last thousand. Just bring it. Almost having the Bravo unboxing secured here. 525 on top of the 5500. Come on. Yes. And the 25, like that. So. Now the only thing we really need to make money for is the CSGO weapon case, um, stat track guarantee and of course the keys. Cheers guys. Come on. You know you can do it. Right on 6200. So close. Can almost taste it. 150 left and then we are home safe oh yeah come on Package is secured. Just gonna tap it up to six thousand. Not six thousand. That would be silly. That would be tapping down, really. Tapping up to seven thousand. Um, just because I do like having a bit of a pocket change. The truth is I love clicking, um, but I really want to go do the unboxings, so I'm really, I mean some days I just, you know, decide, you know, okay, I'm just going to tap to 15,000 because I really do like clicking, but today, I really just want to go open stuff. And it is so close now. Oh yes it is, oh yes it is. I figured I would do 7,050 so I have like a clean 500 left like that so guys that was pretty much it from uh, me here in this video raked in about 7,000 got some Bravo cases got some CSGO weapon cases hopefully answered the questions that you guys had about tapping and case searching so um, yeah I hope you guys enjoyed please do consider the the puzzle uh, question I asked if you know any cool like puzzle games you want uh, to recommend please do so because there is nothing cooler than trying out games recommended by others that enjoy the same time of games like yourself so uh, I'm hoping that you guys know some crazy cool puzzle games that you want to recommend to me my recommendations right now are of course uh, the room and human resource machine but I'm gonna be adding to that as I discover and play new games all the times. For now guys, thank you very much for watching.